It's such a delight to enjoy coffee of this quality. I'm glad he likes it. <laughs> you could stay until you find a place, you know. I can't promise that it'd be comfortable here, though. Through that. <laughs> Thank you, but I'll return to the dorms. I realized something after talking with everyone last night. Wait, but I thought he thought we used the cards. Wait, wait, okay, now, need, now we gotta know how to use ability cards in Persona 5. Okay, let's see. Oh, wait, let's pick it on the items menu. Oh, I'm an idiot. Okay, sure. Perhaps it's due to my upbringing, but yep. I don't know anything of the world, let alone other people. Yeah, you were pretty much of a shot in true that. If I'm to depict people in my art, I need to learn more about them. I must interact with them more. Oh, good for you, man. I'll return to the dorms and start over by talking with the people closest to me. So well, still a sure. I see. <laughs> Good on you for realizing that yourself. There's no need to exaggerate. May I come again sometime to enjoy your coffee? Of course you can, right? Of course. My doors oh. are always open. There we go. Except the night. He's been through a lot too, from what I've heard. Mm -hmm. Are you related to him? Huh? Oh. Uh, <laughs> how would I describe it? We're just acquaintances, not family or anything. Oh, uh, well. I may be overstepping my bounds, but why did you decide to take him in? Actually, well, I want to know that too, sure. My reason, huh? <laughs> Probably because he reminds me of my old self. Well, you tried stepping up for someone who got screwed as well. Well, are not that uncommon. <laughs> That's all? <laughs> you know how it is. Sympathy makes you do stupid things sometimes. Your art instructor, <laughs> um, former art instructor, he must have felt something for you too, besides just stealing your talents. Yeah, hopefully. Truth be told, <laughs> I cannot hate him from the depths of my heart either. I should probably get going. Mm, okay, get going, here we go. Hey, you sure about this? The painting, I mean. It'd be a waste to keep here. Yeah, like, yeah that's good. Even mm. if I kept it at the dorms, it'd mm. only be met with skepticism. I doubt it would want that. Pretty painting your nuts. Adding a hint of color yeah. to an otherwise ordinary day. I'm sure my mother would have done the same. Mm. Nuts. Yeah. I'll hold on to it for you then. I think it's good enough to have in, right? Thank you for the coffee. I'll come again. Hmm. I'll look forward to it. Nope. Hmm. Hey! You're finally awake. You're crossing the border. Where's you? <laughs> where's you scheme? Yeah, where's you scheme? He wasn't around when I woke up. He must be downstairs. Man, it's, it's killing me, yeah. Or not that. My nose is up. You're finally up. You know it's past noon. That kid ended up going back to his dorms. <laughs> he left this painting before he took off, though. Supposedly to thank us for taking care of him. Scary. It's rare, it's rare to see a kid acting so grateful these days. Yeah. And this painting is amazing. Not only is the mother stunning, but the expression on her face. The regulars will probably freak out when they see it in here. Yeah. I feel like I've seen it somewhere. It's a bit different from how I remember it, though. Hey. Well, if you're up for the day, go on and get dressed. I opened up. Sh I opened shop hours ago, so I go take the cat out somewhere. Sure. Oh, thank you again for letting me stay the night. Apologies for leaving so quietly, but your rest seemed peaceful. After a great deal of inner struggle, I have decided to return to the dormitories. Furthermore, I have entrusted the Sayuri to your protector, Sojiro. That painting should be that painting should no longer exist in reality, but it is truly what my mother painted. I am simply satisfied that we were able to obtain it. And it was all because of you guys. I cannot thank you enough. Yes, I still believe porridge is the best way to end a hot pot. No, no. 
Oh, I need that. Hey, hey. Oh, East Game went home, huh? Oh, well, I guess that's best. Yo, I just checked the fan site. There's some kind of thread on there looking for info about burglars using the Phantom Thieves name. Sounds pretty lame to me. No, I saw that too. They target restaurants, right? I actually found a really interesting post on there. My brother has suddenly started acting violent towards everyone. I might end up getting killed at this rate. I wonder if it's because he got caught up with all those weird people in Shibuya. You think he means those burglars when he's talking about them weird people? It may be too soon to- it may be too soon to assume that. The post said he started spending a bunch of money lately, too. Isn't that kind of suspicious? I wonder how many burglar groups there are even in- I wonder how many burglar groups there even are in Shibuya. Dang, things are really starting to get serious. Let's look into it. I thought you'd say that. Although, how exactly will we go about investigating? We'll go to Shibuya in the middle of the night and catch them all red-handed. No way, the police would totally nab us if we were out that late. Plus it would plus it would be bad if the chief knew you were out in the middle of the night. Hmm, they target restaurants. Ah, what if we drew them to LeBlanc? What? Oh no. There's no way, who would go after a shop like this? Wouldn't that cause a lot of trouble for boss? LeBlanc targeted? It seems like a viable plan to me. The raw dim, no. Yep. I mean, you'd get kicked out of a LeBlanc if we failed. Oh, I suppose I left Sayuri there as well. I had forgotten. How'd you forget something that important? Either way. I don't really want more thieves to be posing as us in the future. I wish there was some way we could make an example of these ones. At the moment, our lack of info means we will just have to wait. We can continue searching for more information wherever possible, though. Yeah. I'm gonna try looking for stuff too. Oh, I think we hold dating in it. Hey! I can't believe he just went home without telling us, although that tactlessness is very useful. Well the room, here we go. Yeah, they're in the bow, eh? Hey, inmate! Don't have time to be playing around, inmate. Hurry back to your prison, yeah. Don't kick me, I know you are. I don't like him. Kick man. It annoys me. Oh. Hmm. Huh? Oh, that's... Would seem... I see you have brought us and now I'm gonna use me with Frey. <laughs> huh. Very well. Your assignment's done. Very well. It is commendable that you have chosen to work so diligently toward your rehabilitation. Huh. huh. I guess at least you've got the will to work. Of course. Don't give me that smug attitude. This is your duty, inmate. <sighs> that's it. You have completed this task. No. You have completed the task surprisingly easily. Yeah. It might actually be worth our time after all. Justine, tell him his next attack. Justine, tell him his next task. It's on that list, correct? Indeed. Now then, I will assign your next attack. I will assign you your next task. I hate man. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. Keep getting my tongue tied, man. You heard that the tasks on this list will increase in difficulty as we go. Are you prepared? Of course. <laughs> how, uh, how admirable. Admirable. I feel my bond with Carolyn and Justine is growing deeper. Strength too, sure. All right. What we need. Once again, we would like to bestow a new privilege upon you. However, it is exceedingly powerful. We ask that you fulfill another task before receiving it. Life isn't gonna just end you success. Farewell. Now, I will assign you your next task. Beezy, 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 beezy. Now. Try to harbor a florus, a florus with Taru Kaja. We send you. Florus with Taru. You only, you only, you only need to speak with us once to obtain it. We will be able to tell. Hey. Got it. The florus with the skill Taru Kaja. Florus with them. Um, Taru Kaja, sure. Any changes? Any changes to your health? Let's do a follow up just in case. The exam is ready, so all I need is uh, all I need is the exam is ready, so all I need is a sample. The can be is waiting for you at the clinic. Want to you want to go here? Is that there? Let's try look here.
There's all be now 616, huh? Right now we're at zero. I want to see if we win. Hi. So far we have zero. Yeah. Well then. Middle. No, you have 200, Gary. It's like real life, man. It suddenly wraps up during the evening prep. I have to help with, uh, two days of speeches or whatever. Do you have a moment? I'd like to get your thoughts on Madarami's plagiarism scandal. It's pathetic. Do you hear what he's saying? The, this use thinks that the world is pathetic for being so easily deceived. Modern Japan robs the young of their hope, and dirty politics casts a dark shadow over us all. And that's all for our, our on-the-spot coverage. Let me give you the truth to you, the Phantom Thieves are the Apostles of the Sun God. I didn't know that. That's right, young man. Those who believe will be saved. Great Sun God, are you not going to have your Apostles of Phantom Thieves punish the evil doers? Or are you not? Their mission has already been appointed. The good news shall reach everyone in time. Okay, let's get going here. Throw it away. Okay, I'll be waiting. Here we go. I'm back. Uh -huh. A patient asked me if, if I had a pair. Nope, wrong, wrong word. A patient asked me asked me if I had a recommendation for a pair of reading glasses, but I'm not an optometrist. Oh, is it because I have an eye test chart on the wall? You came because you saw my messages, right? I want to do a clinical trial. In that case, can you let me check your progress, man? It's all getting big. Mm, I hate the, I hate getting called that though, man. So what are you gonna do? Wanna hang out with Takemi? Sure. But she gives us good stuff. She has lots of good stuff, so I want, I want the stuff, right? Takemi is pleased. She was able to collect useful data. I feel like my bond was to give me a grow stronger soon. Bye. Maybe you can help me out again sometime. Don't, don't take me out. I need, to, I need to be there. I need to buy stuff. Ah, you're back. So what do you want to do about our next big big target? Well, that's sudden. Well, after what the guy said, sitting around doing nothing just pisses me off. You're talking about that catchy kitten, right? I know how you feel. Ah, uh, the high school detective. You'd have to shut up if we changed another person's heart. You think so? Come on, you gotta be more confident about this kind of stuff. But he did mention that the police are starting to mobilize. Either way, I don't think we should leave a catch couldn't be. This is the perfect time to meet and discuss what our strategy what our strategy should be going forward. Let us gather at the hideout tomorrow. By the way, your phone is vibrating, make sure you check it alright. Speech help, here we are. I'd like to request your speech, your help with another speech. I've been feeling more courageous with you around. How have you scheduled looking today? You agreed to a deal with Yoshida. Be sure to accept his invitations until you gain his trust, okay? Yeah. I'll be right there, thank you. Please come to the front of Shibuya Station. I'll be waiting. I need to gain his trust now. Give me a second, I need to do something. Everyone. That you possess free will does not mean that you can always do as you please. To make your decisions based simply on loss and gain is to act like a heartless machine. The reason so few people care about their fellow man is because so few have the energy to do so. We politicians have fallen short of our goal to change society. We need your support more than ever. That approach isn't going to work. You have to get the voters more excited. They're going to completely lose the hearts and minds of the people. Again, what I'd like to say is... No good Yoshida or something. Councilman Matsushita? Huh. Oh. I thought they were going to do the nickname on him again. Whatever. It's been so long since we last spoke. I wanted to stop by to see how you were doing. If you actually one of the good ones or a bad one, that's a question though. Yeah, whatever. Oh, you have a high schooler volunteering for you. Oh, my time. Times have changed. Do you know about the Kuromato Clinic? Children. The Kuromato Children. Yes, Mr. Yoshida told me. 
That was nearly 20 years ago. I'm impressed that you were so interested in politics. I was a member of the Kuromoto children as well. Yoshida and I joined the same year. I made an amazing career change, going from a pro wrestler to a diet member. I was elected easily, but I had no idea what I was doing. I realized I wasn't elected on my own merit when I failed to be re-elected for a second term. That was true for the most of us. No. You made a great comeback though, you're truly an inspiration. How's are you old friend? You're working harder than anyone on the campaign trail. Oh, there's no need for false praise to impress the boy here. Yoshida's well informed. Yoshida's well informed about the inner workings of politics. I'm sure he'll be a great teacher. However, I suggest you only do as he says and not as he does, if you want to become a diet member. Hmm? And what the and what might that mean? I'm guessing he doesn't know. You really think you can win the election by being a completely honest and making good arguments? By being completely honest and making good arguments? You got to secure votes, or else you'll be forever known as no good Torah. Now ah, there it is. What? Without honesty and good arguments, there could be no political justice. Yeah, it's been a while since I've heard one of your grandiose speeches. Henry Kun, was it? Tell me, what about Yoshida here drew you in? The speaking skills, yeah. Henry Kun, haha. Here we go. Well, that's quite impressive. Just may have the potential to become a diet member. You address matters quite directly for a young person. It seems you have been taught well. I intend to teach him everything I know. That's what we agreed on. Yeah, haha. <laughs> I feel like your bond with Yoshida is going deeper. So, I'm allowed you to ask for a large amount of money during negotiations. Heck yeah. All right. Your son's confidence has increased to rank 3. You are now in more XP and fundraising, sure. By the way, how are things between you and old man Kuromoto? Yes. We're still not on speaking terms. Oh, sorry. There's something I'd like to get your opinion on, so I'll be in touch. Very well. Oh, that reminds me. You may still distrust me because of what happened with the missing party funds. But I'm not the one who pointed the finger at you, that's all I'm going to say. Why did you have to mention that? Oh, my apologies, that's all for today. Well then, I'll Good. see you again. Good job. Good job. Hello, thanks again for your help today. What a mess. Past mistakes can really come back to bite you. It's hard to feel like you've ever truly escaped them. Some people can fight their way back up like Matsushita, but many end up suffering under the weight of labels. Even after 20 years, I'm still nothing more than no good Torah, but I will not give up. It's true that I lost a lot, but uh, but I did learn a great many things along the way. Somewhere in the middle of it all, my old stubbornness was tempered into conviction, my one redeeming quality. That is why I want you to use your experiences to forge your own conviction. You think I'll ever find it? Don't worry, I can already see you're on your way. You just have to refine your experience into knowledge. Ah, I ended up talking longer than I expected. Well, until next time. Oh uh, yeah, sure, sure, sure. Hopefully we're fine. <gasps> Lottery, wait, don't we? Oh, is it catchy? Oh, go away. I don't like you. Go, shoot. <laughs> Screw you with your stupid sense of justice, man. Fancy seeing you here. Alright, I guess Shujin was in this direction too. Still, I wouldn't have expected to run into you at this time. Perhaps it really is fate. How are you doing? Huh, <sighs> I'm sleepy. Huh? Did you stay up too late? Are you alright? Ah, I do like that response. It's honest, and it keeps the conversation from dragging. I've been getting interviewed a lot lately, so I've been wondering how to answer such questions. Mm. I suppose it's... A, I suppose it, is it... Give me some tight man. I suppose it is best to simply be yourself and say what you think. You've given me much to consider. If it isn't too much trouble, may I speak with you again sometime? You know what to say, keep your friends close and your enemies closer, but he probably has the same opinion. <laughs> hey, I heard from one of my upperclassmen, but apparently there's some kind of weirdo Kichi Yoji. Even at a glance, you can supposedly tell right away that he's bad news. You live there, don't you? Are you okay? 
Oh, you mean the old man in Harmony Alley? My parents were talking about him too. Doesn't that just make you wonder? I'm thinking I might try looking for him today. Didn't we already help him? Wow, don't do that. Besides, besides, I heard he hides his face. Who knows what it'll do to you if he sees you? You're gonna end up in you're gonna end up in a ditch somewhere. I just know it. Mm. Did they say Kichijoshi? Did we ever see someone like that? It just sounds like a rumor, though. So who knows how much of it you can believe? Like the sauce, yeah. What do you think, Melodius? Hmm, I'm curious, yeah. Right. Yeah. If on the off chance he really is a bad guy, we should do something about it. For now, we can just check it out whenever we have the time. Okay, prep. Prep. I don't know it. Can you get him some... Wait, I'm not gonna... If I don't know it, I'm checking. Yeah. Yeah. It's very free knowledge, so why not, right? That's my opinion on the matter, and that's what my opinion's gonna be. You know what I mean? Before I realized it, we're halfway through June. It's the only month of the year with no holidays, and it's filled with rain. Really a season of hell. I'm exaggerating, you say. Haha, <laughs> you're all just ignorant. After all, what's falling from the sky is acid rain that can melt metal. And we can. Let's test your knowledge and imagination. Give it a try. When washing your hair with dissolved copper, your hair color changes. What color do you think it turns? Blue. Green. I mean, it actually doesn't change because you wash it and it's not going to be that simple. I can't really think blue because we're doing blue. There isn't even blue, but I think blue because like, oh, uh, uh, carbon off it. I'm thinking green. Wait, that's what you're right? Nice. Green. This is it. <laughs> that is correct. By the way, magnesium turns your hair white and rust will turn your hair red. However, acid rain can't melt gold or silver. If you want to dye your hair gold, use bronze coins. Thinking you could save money by skipping a visit to the hair salon. It seems you still don't understand the horror of acid rain. You just learn. Look, after this, I'm just, I've done this like at least 15 times, I'm not doing it again, man. I need my, uh, kindness and charm up a lot. We do have a book for charm. Dude, I can do kindness by helping clean, so it should be fine. Uh, okay. London once had acid rain on the level of stomach acid. More than 4,000 people died. Perhaps one day such a deathly rain will fall on Japan. Oh, yikes, it's bad. My heart, too, is overcast. Just like the rain that falls on the city. Ah, right. Oh, I'm tired of thinking up witty comments. I'm trying to get to a comfortable position. Ha. Huh. Oh, good. You haven't gone home yet. Oh, uh, yeah, I haven't. Nijimisan's looking for you. Could you head to the student council room right away? No, she fine. says there's no report of a lost item, so she wants you to start filling out some paperwork. You returned an item. Oh, who's Nijima? Yeah. Nijima-san is the class president of Shujin Academy. Oh, okay, sure. The student council room is on the third floor, next to the library. Sure. Got it. Yeah, yeah. Why am I running hmm. errands for a student? I know she's the principal's favorite or whatever. Am I your favorite? Maybe. Nijima's the girl who keeps following you around, right? 